Hey guys, welcome to Testing Academy. Uh, this is one of very interesting questions someone asked me that okay, uh, what are the career change option after? Means I am right now at a one year of experience, two years of experience in QA. What are the uh, what are the different career options I can change to? Right. So we are going to discuss about them and we're going to discuss about how you can do it and a couple of tips and tricks in the end. Right. So th- let's get started. All right, guys. Let me make myself a little smaller. Yes. So uh, someone asked me that okay, uh, as a manual tester, can I make a uh, career change and other than testing? So basically, my point is, uh, let's assume that uh, probably uh, like I have seen in couple of MNCs, right, uh, where they just put you in the certain kind of a testing environment, right? I mean, uh, you are starting your career, you applied as a software tester or software engineer. Even your prof- even your profile is software engineer. you are working as a software tester in that case right so you have started your career as a software testing in that that case and uh, so it is randomly decided it means you haven't uh, decided that okay i want to become a tester in that case that case right so what should i do now i have completed one year two year three years uh, four years right right now uh, i have seen couple of people who have done like 8 to 10 years of performance testing and they don't want to do performance testing in their career right so what do you what they can do right so these are the couple of options that i have highlighted and i'm going to talk one by one like how you can do it and uh, if i have seen like these kind of people or not right so uh, suppose i'm assuming right now you are at a senior qa level right or you are at a qa level suppose you have a one to three years of experience and uh, right now you want to move to a role right so uh, this is the role which is basically dev role right uh, you can move to front end back end i mean i have seen lots of people moving up like if the span is one to give me one yeah so uh if the span is one to three years means right now you are at a one to three years of your software testing career right you can definitely switch to uh, dev roles if you are performing if because uh, i have seen the the qas already have the same skill set that the developers have right uh they know programming means if you if you know programming right i have seen couple of people don't know programming then it's very difficult to switch to a dev role in that case right so if you know a particular programming if you know if you are good at decent at sql and all right if you are good at decent uh, in back end technologies definitely go with the dev role right so dev role is for you in that case and second role which is very important which is let me put you in this which is dev ops and because qa ops is already becoming popular you can go to devops where you will be handling the servers different cloud services right uh, installing the things uh, basically handling ci cd pipelines right and deployment as well as different servers right so this is the thing which uh, where in devops most of the time people prefer python and all other different languages and uh, these two rules uh, these two roles i mean i have seen qa people specially going towards more right uh, third thing is the ba i would say so ba i have seen people are uh, basically becoming business analyst uh means they don't want to do the, the manual stuff or the i mean say uh, not manual even the automation stuff that they want to do in the testing career right so they will move to ba in that case so i have seen lots of people moving towards ba uh scrum master is another thing where basically people prefer uh, basically they learn about the scrum agile and all and uh, in so uh, they take certain certifications like psm1 psm2 and after that they move towards the scrum uh, so basically they become scrum master program manager tpm technical program managers and after that career they goes right last two things are customer support let's see yes i have seen people moving towards qa2 customer supports and customer to qa support so it's a vice versa customer engineering basically helping the customer to set up their a uh, tools or whatever the services that they are providing right so you can move that sys sysop admins again uh, it's very similar very similar to the devops but uh, sys mostly related to the sysops that you system uh, operations that you do do with your right do with your organization and all setting up these uh, different systems uh, profiling active directory and all things in the, will basically comes under this right uh, this is one of the interesting option which is the freelancing and i have seen like right now people are moving towards basically whenever they try to uh, they have certain experience like for one two years and all after they move towards the freelancing because in upwork freelancer.com and all they get the projects and they will basically move their journey towards it right so in a nutshell uh, can i make any career change yes you can make definitely you can make uh, if you are at one to three years of experience it's very easy to do it 
after three years it's it's become very uh it's not uh it is not uh hard but it's definitely not easy after you have three plus years of experience especially in india i would say or asia specific if you're in usa or australia you can change most of the time if you are good at programming definitely go with the devops and uh, dev role right you can go the do that but india i have seen specially uh if you have three plus years of experience it's very difficult to switch to other role uh especially with the dev roles right you can move to scrum master role bas uh, sysops or devops but uh, moving to dev dev role after 3 plus years experience is very difficult it this is my just a personal experience that i have seen so do let me know uh, in the comment uh, if you have changed your career uh, from qa to dev role or anything if you have planned to do it right do let me know in the comment i'll be happy to discuss we can have a discussion on our facebook group regarding this week means how you can do it means i have tried not tried i would say i would say uh, like there are like 100 time these kind of thoughts come like let's move to dev role dev ops role and all but uh, i don't know i just uh, love doing the stuff related to qa and all that's why i still i am uh, with they like eight plus years experience right so do let me know uh, what do you think about this video let me know in the comment do you think uh, it is helpful uh, yeah and thanks a lot for watching i'll see you in the next video bye